Hello everyone and welcome to today's video where we are going to talk about silkworm farming also known as sericulture. So this is the process of keeping a special type of caterpillar that produces fabric throughout the year. Okay, there are two types of silkworm farming. The first one is known as wild silk where you, t you go and get silkworms that are in the wild and you harvest the silk without the need to domesticate them. Then there is another form of silkworm farming known as domesticated and under domesticated silkworm farming there are two types. The first one is known as mulberry and the second one is known as non-mulberry. The most common type of silkworm farming is the mulberry. So to start a silkworm farm, the first thing that you need is land where you're going to plant trees that will give you a lot of leaves to feed your silkworms. Then you also need a planting material. Ideally select a plant that bears many leaves so that you have a lot of leaves to feed your silkworms. Then you'll also need a silkworm rearing house. Then inside the rearing house, you'll need to install appropriate rearing equipment such as rearing beds, mountages, a sprayer pump and chopping boards. After you have each and everything that is mentioned here, then you'll need to get silkworm eggs from approved silkworm breeders. Okay, don't just buy them from anywhere, buy them from approved breeders. Then ideally you need training for at least two weeks from a reputable government organization or a private organization. Okay, the best way to learn silicon farming is through apprentice apprenticeship. Okay, so that's all about silicon farming. See you guys in the next video.